Good hello everybody, hope you're doing fine. If you're not, hang in there mate, you got this. I'm ironically screaming and I have a new video. Speaking of new things, I also have a new chair! It's a lot better than my old chair because my old chair was just fucking squeaky as hell and uncomfortable and this one's really nice. I, I, am, I am not sponsored by chairs. I'm starting off way off topic. Anyway, I have another little rant video for you. I have some pet peeves written down here. I've got four of them because I can't make long videos because my computer over here sucks. But anyways, let's get right into it. Right in... Oh, oh I need to go kill myself now that I said that. So number one is people who drive on the wrong side of the road. So here in Finland we have a system called right side traffic where basically if you're driving in a car you're on the right side of the road and this people follow more or less. This is like people are okay with it and people know what to do because because I mean obviously if you don't know what to do when you're on the fucking car road get off the road if you don't know what you're doing you're a danger to everybody else but a little lesser known fact here in Finland is we don't only have right side traffic with cars we have right side traffic with everything else as well you know bicycles and pedestrians. And some people might think, well, it's no big deal if I ride my bike on the left side of the road now and then, no one's gonna come out. Well, say that to me when I go around a corner and I crash headfirst into you because you're too fucking stupid to follow the rules. Like, I am a person, and whenever I go out, pretty much like 90% of the time, I'll be on my bike. Watch him roll it, watch him go, watch him roll it, watch him go. And I'll probably be going fast as well. <laughs> And when I'm going fast, the last thing, the last thing that I want to do is to crash into someone else because they were on the left side of the road. Not to even mention having to like brake really fast and having like a heart attack because Becca from Dalosari didn't follow the rules. And it's even worse when there's like pedestrians on the cyclist path. Like it is like in Finland, the pedestrian and cyclist path, they are even different colors. And if that wasn't enough for you, there's even like the fucking signs on the roads with bicycle and humans. And there's still people just literally standing in the entire middle of the freaking bicycle lane. Like no joke, I was cycling one day and I was just going about and there was this woman and two little boys bang smack in the center of the freaking cyclist path. And they took up the entire cyclist path. There was even another little slip of like tiles for you to stand on to fix your shit so that you're not in anyone's way. It was literally right next to them and they were just on the freaking cyclist path like, oh, no one's gonna come out. Fuck you. Not you guys. I, I, was, I was like talking to the, uh, the woman and the two kids. You guys are cool. Please don't unsubscribe. And then it's stoners who post videos of themselves getting high online. They probably think that it's really empowering or beautiful or cool to do it it's not you just look like a fucking asshole look i'll just be on top i'll just be scrolling and then i come across a video and it's like it's just this fat girl and she just has a freaking bong and she's lighting it and fucking putting her mouth on it and that looks really bad oh no it, that, that will look really bad that just looks like i'm drinking something and it's like first off you're posting videos of yourself doing something very unhealthy. Second off, why the fuck are you posting videos of yourself stoning? Is that is that the verb? Stoning? It's just like, I could just like, go to one of those blogs and just like, cringe compilation, this blog, and then this one. This is the most relatable thing ever that I will ever have on this channel. When you accidentally rip out your headphones. It's just like, you're just listening to some nice tunes, listening to Heathens by 21 Pilots, which I did not download illegally, I paid for it. Don't sue me! And you're just tying your shoes, and then you like, you like pull your leg down, or you stand up, and your headphones just get caught in your knee, and then just... They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine, when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. And it's just like, the entire world around you has just collapsed, and you're just left in this state of... Speaking of relatable things, one of my pet peeves absolutely is when YouTubers know they're very close to being forgotten, so they try to be relatable. These are YouTubers like, they used to be good but now they're not getting any views, so they try their hardest to be relatable by being like, oh, the outside world, what's that? Oh, exercise, what's that? Oh, healthy eating, what's that? Like, you're trying to be relatable by promoting an unhealthy lifestyle. Like, 
Get off YouTube. No one wants you. You just you should just accept that that you're dying. Leave. But anyway, that was four of my pet peeves, and I'm just gonna leave this video here because otherwise my laptop's gonna crash and uh, there won't be any video. Like it, give it a like button and shake a little tickle. If you wanna see more, give it a subscribe button and shake a little tickle. It's increasingly harder to say that fast. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Thank <music> you.